It's time for more Minecraft Bingo. This time I've got Seed 2002, which I'll be playing Blind for Bingo. If you want to play the Seed Blind for Bingo to post your scores in the Minecraft Bingo subreddit, then quit watching now. Put this video in your Watch Later queue and come back after you've already played. I am looking at this card, and my analysis is that the first column should be pretty straightforward and reliable. It requires 16 iron, but the rest of it is relatively straightforward to get. The fifth column, if there happens to be a chicken near spawn, we could get the egg reasonably quickly. The fish, we'd have to get some string for the fishing rod, might be a little bit dodgy. But if there is a chicken near spawn, then the fifth column would also be a good option. But I think I'm probably going to go for the first column. So... Let's go ahead and start the game and just quickly look around. I don't hear, oh, there are chickens there. Okay, in that case, and we're in a swamp, so the cave, all right, maybe we'll go for the fifth column then. So in that case, let's go ahead. I could dig up the clay. We'll hope to get some string somewhere. I only need one piece of iron for the flint and steel and we need to get some bone meal for the skeleton and kill a squid. But since the chickens are there, in five minutes or so, we're probably likely to get an egg. And I will choose to chop down some of the swamp trees, just in case for some reason I need to go back to trying to get apples back on the first column, because these trees have a lot of oak leaves and are most likely to drop the apples. And... Yeah, since I am going to need a little bit of iron, I think I'll still kind of go with the normal tools that I'm going to get. And we'll need to get a furnace going quickly so we can cook up the brick. Alright, but there's at least one swamp tree cop chopped down. It's not necessarily going to give me an apple, but at least gives me a chance in case I need to fall back. Let's go ahead and do this. Where can I find some stone nearby? I see some exposed stone right over here. And since this is right here, I'll go ahead and quickly grab the clay so that I can immediately get that smelting. And the chickens should be in render distance over there. Is that a mushroom biome over there I see? I think that's a mushroom biome. That's pretty cool. The tiny biomes of Minecraft Bingo let you see a lot of things during Minecraft Bingo gameplay that you wouldn't normally encounter all that frequently in normal Minecraft. Things like mushroom biomes and ice spikes. I guess to some extent like jungles as well. Okay, and I see a squid swimming over there, so I'll want to kill him. I'm going to get 12 pieces of stone so I can make the tools and things that I want. We'll do this. I just need the one brick, and so I can use my wooden pickaxe to smelt that up. And then I'm going to make these tools... As I always do. Alright, and then let's try to kill tiny little mushroom biome in the tiny biomes. Let's kill the squid. Alright, and we got... Oh no! I need to kill another squid because that registered as squid ink and took it out of my inventory. Uh, didn't I just see another squid right here? I really thought I saw another one. There he is. Because I need it for the gray dye. All right, there we go. Now I've got another piece of squid ink. So the first one registered on my card as the center item. But now this one, and I can go ahead and pick this up. We'll get the brick. And just to make sure I'm staying on track. Yes, okay. Those are the things that I thought I had. And we might end up needing some more wood for something, and so I'm just going to chop this down really quick. Okay, I need to find a cave system so I can get down and find some iron, ideally. And I want to stay close to where those chickens are so that their egg-laying timer will continue to count down. And... Not immediately seeing cave entrance in this area. If I don't see one, I'll just dig down, because if I just need one piece of iron, that ought not be hard to get, although a cave system is also going to be necessary in all likelihood to get the bones... Oh, there's more chickens over here. Okay, that's good to know. To get the bones and the string. We need some dark areas. And there's even more chickens over here. Okay, it's a chicken bonanza. Hey, and I think I see a cave. Is it a cave? Yes. Great. Oh, it's just a tiny little cave. Maybe it goes further over here. Show me darkness. Show me bad guys. Show me coal and iron. Well, here's coal at least, which I could use for smelting the iron. 
And that is at least a dark area where some monsters could spawn. And so let's try to remember that that's there. Because that might be the quickest way to get some monsters nearby. I'm going to do a little bit more circling around here. To try to find some mobs. Or a cave. Could always stumble on a, on a dungeon on the surface as well. Actually, let's take a look since there's a desert over here. Sometimes you can just kind of see see them on the surface. And actually, I don't want to kill the chickens because I want them all to be laying the eggs, but I see some other mobs over here, and I might need the food. Hello, bunny rabbits. So I'm going to kill these sheep so I can cook up some mutton. So that if I am fighting skeletons, I'll have some food to heal up. And then while I'm over here, another quick look. Do I see any caves? Not seeing any caves over here. All right, I may just dig down from where the chickens are, because I think that might be the fastest thing to do. And there's no reason for me to kill you, bunny, so I will let you live. <laughs> I'll let you live, and then all of a sudden he jumps down and takes fall damage on his own. Ah, what a character. Sometimes also with night vision you can see, like, cave entrances in the bottom of the ocean, where, like, a ravine opens up or something, so I should take a look at that. Not seeing anything immediately, though. Oh, is this cave? Hold on. Nope, just another tiny little dark spot that hasn't spawned any mobs. Oh, and I hear cows as well. Wow. All right, I am going to set my furnace down. Hello, is there something here? Uh, oh, there's iron. Okay, great. Let's go ahead and get the food cooking up, and the same piece of coal will be able to cook up the iron as well in just a moment. I can always get back up over there. I only need the one piece for the row that I'm going on. So we'll do that. Um... All right, and the eggs should be laying uh, momentarily. Let's go ahead. I think three pieces of mutton will be good for now, and let's go ahead and get the iron cooking. So let's do this. We'll get our iron. I need a flint, and so I need to find some gravel. Have you guys laid any eggs yet? Hurry up. I should have been paying attention in the little caves that we peeked into. I forgot to look and see if there was gravel. Oftentimes you'll find it just kind of with exposed stone like there is on the surface over here, however. So perhaps I'll see some gravel right over here. No, don't see gravel there. All right, we'll visit these chickens as well and see if any of them have laid eggs already. Have you got an egg? You got an egg for me? What you got? Oh, I heard it. I heard someone poop an egg. Where is it? I demand to know. I just heard one of these guys lay an egg. And another one. There it is. Okay, great. All right, there's my egg. We're still looking for gravel, and we need to find some mobs. I mean, obviously, if I wait another three minutes or something, mobs will start spawning on the surface at night. But I would prefer find them sooner than that. Just gonna peek in here really quick, see if any mobs spawned. Right down here is kind of the darkest section. But no, all right. And again, I was forgetting to look for the gravel, but I don't think I saw any right there. All right, there's gotta be some gravel somewhere in the world. I think I'll go back to my furnace and just start digging down if I can't find any. Yeah, I'm not seeing gravel. All right. <laughs> now there's eggs everywhere. And actually, these guys give really good food, uh, even if it's not cooked. And so let's go ahead and kill. Oops, wrong tool. <laughs> kill these guys. All right. We're back to the furnace. We have that. I'm going to cook up some more, because why not? And I guess just start digging down from here and hope that we find ourselves a cave system with some mobs. Because I need bone for bone meal for the gray dye. I need a cave full of gravel. <laughs> I guess I'll just dig straight down. Oh, I hear a zombie. Hold on. And a spider. I need the spider for the string. And here's a gravel. Okay. Everything's coming up Millhouse. 
All right, show me a flint. There's the flint. Okay, great. I'm going to go ahead and do the flint and steel right now before I forget. And I hear these guys. They're like right over here. And the spider is the one I should be going to. It sounded like the spider was to the right. Let's see. If I go down, do they get louder? Hmm, not really. Is the spider above me? Aha! There's a cave. Okay, great. Um, let's take a risk. Oh my goodness, there's a lot of bad guys in here. There's my string. Oh! Creepers! Creepers! So many creepers! Have you ever seen so many creepers? <laughs> Yikes! Um... There we go. <laughs> All right, I got the string to the fishing pole. Um, I did not see a skeleton here yet. Let me get back up to the surface and go ahead and fish, and then it'll be uh, nighttime on the surface, I think. And uh, we'll be able to find the skeleton there. Um, but let me go ahead and get the fishing going on, I think is the plan. <laughs> there were, seriously, there was like seven creepers there, right? I guess it was like a couple of different pack spawns in the same area. Okay, I want to leave this open in case I do need to go down into a cave. Okay, basically, where's my furnace again? Or, I don't need the furnace again. What I need to do is set down the crafting table and make the fishing rod. And I can just sit right around here. All right, I'm a little wound up at this moment. But we got the egg. We've got the flint and steel. We're about to get the fish, and then I would just need to kill a skeleton. I should have gotten another piece of iron so I get a shield. That would have been a smart thing to do. All right, here comes fish. Oh, no. Oh, a bone. That's what I need. <laughs> kind of. Because now I can do this. Awesome. And there's a fish. That's bingo. Wow. Super lucky. Super, super lucky. Um... Yeah, can you believe that? I fished up a bone. It didn't even occur to me that that was a possibility, so I didn't even have to fight a skeleton. And I managed to get that right column in 10 minutes and 52 seconds. I am very pleased with that time. Wow. Super, super lucky. I will click this line to teleport back to the lobby, and I will give myself an offering of... The fishing roll... Fishing roll. Fishing rod of destiny. Congratulations to me... Once again, we had a time of 10 minutes and 52 seconds. I look forward, as always, to comparing times with all of you. You can post your scores on the Minecraft Bingo subreddit. And I hope, as always, that you guys are having a great day. Bye-bye.